Well, if you are looking for family fun here in our area, the city of Elizabethton is working overtime to make sure your kids have a good time. From parties in the park to holiday parades, here with all the details now is Kelly Kitchens with the city of Elizabethton. Always fun when Kelly joins us on the show. <laughs> you guys have you. so much going on so all the time. So much going on, yes. It's a busy summer already and we're just starting. And Elizabeth, and just downtown with the parks and everything, you have so much to offer every day for the kids. We do, and you know, the best part is being able to move really from park to park to be able to really hit all demographics, um, you know, whether whether or not you're able to make it to Coverbridge Park, if you live by Kiwanis, if you're down by the river, we really try to go all over Elizabethan for what we're doing. And so some of these upcoming events definitely highlights a few of those parks. All right, well, let's talk about the big one you have yes. coming up because I'm super excited. Mario fans yes. can rejoice. We've got Power Up Party. Yes, that's going to be at Kiwanis Park the week after next. So not this Friday, but the next. That's going to start at 7 o'clock. So so if you know this is for everybody this is not just for kids this is for families this is for adults um, I have a couple grown kids who are really looking forward <laughs> to it so you know if you like hot dogs and if you like games and if you like movies and especially if you like Mario you're gonna have a good time uh, this is completely free of charge for everybody to come out and enjoy um, we're gonna start the night off with some dinner for everybody um, we're going to have the, the library there with us. We've got Carter County Drug Prevention with us. We're wanting to highlight that we've got an eSports room now at the Recreation Center um, that we've got open for the summer as well. Um, so come talk to us if you attend this event or give us a call if you're not able to make it. Um, but the night's really going to be a lot of fun. We've got free inflatables for everybody to jump. And then at dark, we've got um, the new Super Mario oh. Brothers movie. So everybody is looking forward to that. <laughs> I kind of wondered if that yes. was going to be part of it. And of course, everybody's talking about that movie. My kids have both seen it. They're like, Mom, you've got to yes, see it. Yes, so, it's the best. And to see it outside, yeah. I just think that's so much fun. Yeah, it is. We did Encanto there last year um, with the same concept. You know, like I said, we, we do try to do, um, you know, things at, at other parks in Elizabethan as well. And so we did Encanto there last year. We had a magician, the inflatables, the food. Um, and really, you pretty much couldn't see grass out in the field. But <laughs> it's such a great park. You know, there's plenty of space. There's plenty of room to be able to spread out. So bring a blend. Blanket, come down and just enjoy the evening with us. Wonderful. And then you're also doing a thing to really get kids' minds working, their wheels turning with yes. their creativity. You know, it's hard to say I have a favorite event because I love all of them, but this one is really close to my heart. This one, um, we, ex we're accepting applications now. This is an event that we hold during Covered Bridge Days in September. Um, we do these applications now just to give the kids the summertime to, you know, if they're artists, if, if they um, are creative in that way and they need to make some product to get ready for this single day market in September. Um, they, they go and they sell their products um, during this, during the single day market, during Cover Bridge Days. They keep 100% of the proceeds. We've got a great sponsor with this event, Carter County Bank. They have covered all the fees for people to participate. Um, and it's just a great way for kids to really think about um, running their own businesses. So they're creating their product, their service, whatever it is that they're selling, they're naming it, they're marketing, and then they're the ones interacting with these customers during the single day market. So it's such a great opportunity for them to learn the ins and outs of running their own business. Man, that is cool. And I know in the past you have seen some amazing business so ventures talented. that these kids are yes. oh, yeah, right? And some of them are even continuing to run those businesses today. So it's so encouraging to see, um, you know, that they've taken this from concept, from idea, and actually forming it into something that they're able to sustain and they are they're so creative so oh it's goodness. very inspiring a lot happening in elizabethton and then it won't be long we'll be talking about the fourth of july you're going to come back and talk to us about the fourth yes, of july yes yes right? i sure am okay because as you can see they've got everything <laughs> happening there at covered bridge park another wonderful opportunity to celebrate independence day hey for more information on all of these two you can check out the website at mainstreetelizabethton.com you can also check them out on facebook for more on the power up party as well with the Parks and Rec. Great to have you, Kelly. Thank you so much.